So I have a quick review slash show and tell on this unit from FridayNightHair.com. Now this is a GLS 52 and I have it in a color 1B. This is definitely not my first time wearing this unit. I have been wearing this unit all week. Today is Friday. School has started back and I did start off wearing this unit to school. I have been wearing this unit for about five days now so I'm sorry you guys that this unit is not fresh out of the package however this unit is still in perfect condition and it's looking absolutely gorgeous don't you guys think now, if you like the GLS 15 then more than likely you will like this unit this unit looks pretty much identical to GLS 15 it has the same curl pattern and everything as that unit except this unit it's longer so personally I actually love this one even more than GLS 15 both are my two favorite units hands down from Friday Night Hair because it's just an effortless curly unit now this unit is about 18 to 20 inches but I did cut about I trimmed it I can't really say I cut it I just trimmed it a little bit at the ends and I also added some layers in the front however it looked totally gorgeous straight out of the package when I put it on my head I was just amazed at this unit at just how natural it looks and how much I just love this texture so when you first get it it doesn't have too many layers in the front so I just added a few layers in the front on both sides just to give me some face framing layers so it can look as natural as possible so I'm going to give you guys a 360 <laughs> You can style this unit in so many gorgeous ways. If you want to see how you can style this unit, go ahead and check out my review on GLS 15. I'll have it linked in the description box because in that video I show you a couple updo styles that you can do with this wig. So I suggest that you go check that video out if you want to see how I would style this unit. So let me give you guys a little bit of details about this unit before I let you guys go. This unit does have two combs in the front, a comb in the back, and adjustable straps. The cap construction is like a medium cap construction. It's not the biggest wig but it's definitely not the smallest so I think you can get away with this unit if your head is a little bit on the larger side and this unit will be perfect for you if you do have a smaller head the parting space on this unit is standard for Friday night hair units you get about two inches of parting nothing much at all I kinda do the flip over method with my Friday night hair units because I usually pick curly units from that website and I like that flip over method type of look with my curly units especially like this I tend to just pull out my edges in the front and blend them with the wig and I'm ready to go that's what I love about curly units they're just effortless the density on this unit is perfect to me it's definitely a full density but it's not too full in my opinion it's not too dramatic it's the perfect amount of hair that you would want to have on a curly unit like this. The luster on this unit straight out of the package is like a medium luster but once you finger comb it out it becomes more of a low luster and I did receive a little bit of shedding upon finger combing this unit out it did get a little bit of frizzy so I did have to cut some of the frizzes out but it wasn't too dramatic the more I wear it the better it gets it's just a all-around gorgeous unit so I hope you guys enjoyed this review if you like this makeup look please let me know down below and thumbs up this video because I will have a makeup tutorial coming up on this look so go ahead and thumbs up this video to let me know that you guys want to see that if you aren't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It is totally free. 
And thank you so much, you guys, for tuning in. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Listen. Listen. We're going to get this cracker fight.